Hi everyone, Arizona here. So what you're about to see was actually intended to be a completely uncut video. It was like over four hours long. However, YouTube does not like videos to exceed that. And I don't have the hardware or the capability to make that demand. So I am going to have to edit this video. So this is me prior to editing the video. And I have like gone back and watched the entire thing in its entirety of four and a half hours. And I do got to apologize for my mic audio. I do have to kind of play with the microphone settings. I am completely new to this, so I apologize in advance if uh, I sound a little off. Uh, the game audio, however, sounds splendid. The, the visuals are like as good as I can get them with what I have. And it's, and it's not that bad. Like... The game is beautiful, as you can see in the title. You, like We all know it. It's my first time playing it. I haven't seen a damn thing about it, so please be respectful in the comments and don't spoil this shit for me. Because there are many... There was a long time on the internet that I had to avoid anything to do with Legend of Zelda because it would just immediate... It, like, just like, like Endgame, don't spoil that shit. Even though I don't care about Marvel, don't spoil shit. Anyway, I don't want to ramble, so from here on you're going to see past Arizona playing Tears of the Kingdom, Legend of Zelda. So, have a good one. Now, I have not touched a Nintendo game in forever. Okay, cool. I got down safe. Sneaky boy. Oh, I'm gonna sneak up on you. You don't know what's about to happen. Okay. Cool beans. We got ourselves a bow. Now, I did not go too far into the story. Like, this is maybe... Like... Some... Like, 20... Not... Like, this is, like, right after you speak to, uh, Raru, I believe his name is. Uh. But pretty much, to recap, for anybody that really does not know the story, is, uh, Link and Zelda go into the, like, undercroft, like, the underdeep of Hyrule Castle. And, uh... They find what I believe to be Ganondorf. I mean, very obviously Ganondorf. That and uh, the Master Sword, as you can see, is decayed and destroyed. So, which that that kind of that kind of hits me in the heart after growing up with Legend of Zelda. Look at the dragon. Ain't that neat? We got matching hair, dragon. Both luscious, beautiful manes.
See that same symbol popped up on the floor before. Oh, whoa. You see, I, I liked the shrines from Breath of the like, Wild. Like, look at this, look at this, look at this. Like, full on, like, TARDIS, Doctor Who shit. Nothing there. But then. Oh, I thought it was, like, gonna. load. Like, it, like it was pre rendered. That would have been great. That's me. Yeah, I know treasure. <laughs> I've played Zelda before, I know this. Oh my god, that's so cool! That is so cool! I don't care how basic it is. Just, that's so cool! Oh, that's so cool. Oh, someone put a counter of how many times I say cool. This light that you will cleanse you. It just uh, reminded me of uh, Nero from Devil May Cry, where he has like the devil arm, and he just like keeps absorbing things every time he he defeated a demon. May the light of blessing grant you the strength you seek. Oh man, that's so neat. That is so neat. I'm not a hunter. Need to re oh. You need to reach your friend. Where's your friend, little buddy? Oh well, yeah, I can see you. Yeah, Korok poop. Hell yeah. yeah.
I just like feel the whistle. I just do this. I just build a torpedo. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Torpedoes. <laughs> Bitch. Bring it, bitch. Bring it, bitch. Uh, uh. <laughs> I came so close to eating all types of shit. Oh my god. <laughs> I solved the puzzle. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck. 
has not stopped me before. can fuse world objects and then fuse like my equipment so what can i do now it's just going to be like stasis i imagine they they'd give us another stasis move upward through solid material and emerge on top mm. what just Just straight up. There would be a treasure chest right here. And that is so cool, though. Take one green. Oh my god, pants. <laughs> pants. Oh. Wait, no, no, no. What? See something with the wings. Okay, that, that like weird little thing that you see for like a split second oddly cool all right now i have like a metric dick load of these charges so we're just gonna pop them in okay, so what all do we got here wing is on a device I can harness lift to ride the wind. To fly farther, try balancing the center of the wing. Oh, it's like a launch pad. What do you have to say, Raru? Zonai devices were a pinnacle of our technology. We built an, an advanced civilization with them and forced for many years. Oh. If you master the use of Zonai devices, your quest will be much easier. Well, fuck yeah, it will. So I think I need a... I need a fan. That's what I need. There we go.
<laughs> this is so cool. What are the mechanics behind this? This is so cool. Alright, dive, dive, dive. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god, it's a, that's right. It's a temple. It means it's a puzzle. God damn it. Hey Zelda. God damn. See all the blue marks on your map? If you can travel instantly to any of them, I'd suggest the one on the bottom of your map. Use the travel function to reach that area quickly. You'll find the last of this island's shrines around there somewhere. Now I think shrines are like the heart pieces. Okay, so do you get light or powers of light? Or heart containers. Okay, what the hell is that? Am I blighted? Well, I assume I was blighted because of the opening sequence of the game. But like, is Link? Like, like, what's up with Link? All right. <laughs>
see you have managed to open the door. You haven't fully recovered yet, but that is to be expected. You're almost beyond saving. By visiting the shrines, and receiving their blessings, you have mitigated some of the corruption's effects. Though our time together has been brief, I am so happy that we finally... everything I can for her. Now it is up to you. Oh. I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up. mechanic is cool, but I hope that is just not like a very normal like way of traversing. I wonder what's going through his mind right now. Like, damn it, my sword! <laughs> oh, it's the dragon. It's got six legs. This insect. just saw you but like i guess in the past like a day ago or some shit bitch you got my sword
We'll do a couple of these shrines. Speedy boy. Maybe like this. Oh no! Wait, like that, like that. Yeah, like that. See, they're really not. Too difficult. They're just little brain teasers to make you think. Which are fun. Really, really spikes to tease them. They all just say the same thing, so if I skip it, they're, they're literally saying the exact same thing all the other shrines say. There are some horses. Shippers rain from the sky? Because I caught you right after it. I'm gonna call you free fall. Hi, hmm. right, little buddy. I wish I had a sail. Oh damn, that really goes. Hey! Hey! 
Bonnie point. I'll take bonnie points. Is that a telescope? Oh, this looks like... Oh, this is from... I thought this was like an enemy base. Look. With these games, I see the fortress. I'm thinking it's an enemy. are you? Hey, that looks interesting. <laughs> she, her scientific yeah. mind has overcome her need to be like, One what the fuck time. happened to your hand? What exactly happened? So when you and Princess Zelda go beneath Hyrule Castle, you discover a mysterious mummy, which suddenly reanimates. Then Zelda falls into a fissure and vanishes. That must have been when the castle rose and the ruins fell. Then, later, you wake up on a sky island, saved by the arm that was stuck to the mummy. You get the Pura Pad from an unusual creature. And learn that your new arm belonged to someone named Rawlu. The Master Sword disappears. You hear the princess's voice and find your way here. Yeah, and then I went off and like uh got a horse. What? What? Hmm. Hmm. Yes.
Witness the blood moon's rise. When its red glow shines upon the land, the endless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. Just as they did. Oh yeah, that's right, there were travel towers in the last game. I totally... Is that a cannon? What is this, Twilight Princess? Again, is this a fucking cannon? <laughs> oh, so this, does this like show like places around me then? my paraglider. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. No, I see the similarity. Like, from like, vague, like very small, like, photographic memory of like the old game. And like, knowing like the map from then, I can see like the layout of the land. So it is very similar. Ah. I feel better. I had like three energy drinks in the past like two hours. Not healthy. I'm like a water fountain in Las Vegas right now. plan to play more of this. I'm going to be pretty much recording every single day of this entire entire deal. I'm loving this game. Now, I might uh, do actual like editing at a later point. So you guys are going to see like vastly different stuff, but for now you're just going to see just unedited content for, for, for the time being. I just don't have the time for editing, but to push something out there I am going to be playing a boatload of Zelda. Uh, ex I'm expect some uh, some Smash Bros. Definitely expect some Smash Bros. Uh, and then just honestly, just more other content. You you'd see me live stream uh, Hell at Loose, Halo, things like that. So yeah, thank you guys for those of you that did go through this entire video with me. Thank you. That is awesome. That is awesome. I expect a lot of people to maybe watch the first like. 20 30 minutes and then just get bored but for those of you that stuck around for the entire time that's awesome of you so i will see y'all in the next one